Hello there YouTube, this is Mike, and I thought I'd try to uh, somehow explain what the uh, leg squeezing video was about. It, I've had a few heart attacks, and um, I can walk down to the driveway to get to bed and walk up, and my chest is hurting so bad, I'm, I have to just stop, just stop out there and stay and wait for a couple of minutes until the pain goes away. Well, anyway, I take nitroglycerin for that, and it's just I've seen it take so much nice nitroglycerin for that that the bomb squad parked outside the door waiting for me to blow up. Well, anyway, the doctor said, you know, there's a procedure here called EECP. He's more or less think it's official type thing, but you know, some people do real well with it, and some people don't. He asked me if I wanted to try it. I go, well, you know, at this point, I've got to try anything with. If I can get up and down the driveway without going, <laughs> say, okay, you set it up. Anyway, what they do with the ECP is, is they put blood pressure type cuffs around your legs and your butt. And in between heartbeats, it squeezes the crap out of your legs. And what that's supposed to do is push the blood back up into your heart and into the little blood vessels. And when it does that, it fills those little blood vessels which will promote the little blood vessels to grow into more little blood vessels, which is apparently where my angina is coming from. And he said, well, see how that works. It's a procedure you go to, uh, I went to, one hour a day, five days a week, for seven weeks. Eh, it was all right. Didn't, it wasn't painful. I had a little black leotards I put on. And I had the headphones so I can watch TV. And while that thing sat there, I went. Hold on a second. Now, I don't know why I didn't get any sound when I did the uh, cell phone thing, but this is pretty much what it sounds like. And as you can see, they have me doing it again. Well, anyway, I did that for seven weeks, and I don't think it worked too good for me. I really don't. I still have chest pains. Maybe not as bad, but, you know, I still have them. So I went to the doctor today, and he said, well, there's not much I can do for you. I've already had uh, two bypass surgeries, two open heart surgeries. So, you know, I'm not, he said, you're not really a candidate to do that again. And I've, you know, I've had some heart casts, so they've gone up in there a few times and opened everything up. So he gave me a new pill. He said, this is a brand new pill, just released this year. And uh, you're the, I only got two patients on, and you're one of them. The, pa the pill's called uh, Renexa. And what I do is for this, I take uh, one twice a day. And hopefully that will... Uh, help uh, my angina a lot better and I want and I can run down the driveway and run back up the driveway and not be oh ooh, ooh, and the bomb squad can go away I won't need my nitroglycerin anymore or not as often so I tell you what I'll start taking these things and I'll keep you upgraded upgraded updated on how things are going with that pill well, anyway it's time for me to get ready and go to work and I will talk to you later. As always, live well, be happy, and don't forget your grape juice. Bye.